other youtubers advice is trash that's why in this video i'm gonna show you how to actually fix lag spikes in fortnite okay so the first thing you gotta do is go to your account then click on settings first of all on display on rendering mode you have to be performance mode please whatever you do please be performance mode it's gonna help a lot and also make sure your fps is capped to unlimited basically this makes your cpu and gpu work harder and that's why i usually avoid lag spikes all right now go to epic games go on library then then find fortnite and click the three dots right here then press on manage and next to the installations press on this folder icon now go to fortnite game binaries win64 and now scroll the way down until you see fortnite client win64 shipping.exe then press on it right click it press properties go to compatibility tick this box right here make sure it says windows 8 and disable full screen optimization and now press apply all right now for the next step all we gotta do is go to the windows search bar and write cmd and make sure to run it as administrator now write sfc slash scan now and press enter now this is gonna check if you have any corrupt files in your system now for the next step we're gonna change our power plant so we need to go to the internet and write ultimate performance power plan and press enter find the website how to geek where it says how to enable ultimate performance power plan for windows 10 it also works for windows 11 by the way now scroll all the way down until you see this line right here and just copy it now go to the windows search bar and write power shell and run it as administrator and paste in the command you copied and press enter now go to windows search again and write edit power plan and click on this one and now go to the top where you see power options and change it to ultimate performance now sometimes the issue is that your storage is full especially when it's red i do recommend that you would clean it up what i do recommend you would do is go to settings then apps and i recommend that you would filter your drives and just find apps that you do not need i hope this video helped you and if it didn't i do recommend that you would join my discord server where we help people fix their problems all you gotta do is go to fix problems channel and then just create a ticket and then the professional will come and help you for really cheap all right, I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.